Hey guys, Happy Nirvana here. Um, this is going to be my weekly update. Uh, one of the things I've been thinking about is trying to get a better uh, release schedule instead of just kind of randomly throwing up things. I haven't you know, set schedule yet. I'm going to try to finalize one within the next week, but it's going to be something like two times a week. I'm going to be doing the um, UK snack t tastings and then one day I'll be doing the uh, travel tips video and then obviously on Fridays I'm going to try to do the update videos now I'm going to have special videos in between there that um, don't fall in uh, per se in that now, when I say the uh, snack tastings, that's not that's the snack tastings, and if I have a UK versus US, so they'll be kind of interspliced. I won't. Obviously, there isn't a lot of uh, UK to US comparisons, like I've had in the Kit Kats and the Maltesers and stuff like that, but. Uh, they will still appear as, as I come across things. And <clears throat> as I go through the UK stuff, eventually I'm probably going, going to start running uh, low in content for there, and that's when I'll expand to other countries. Um, I might just, it'll either be individual countries. Or I might just generalize and just be like European, you know, that way I can do f French, German, Italy, stuff like that. <clears throat> so speaking of snacks, I went to the store today because the original intention of going to the store, well, I had to pick up medication first, but the original intention of going to the store was I was going to get a ring light for the camera because I thought part of the problem my camera's not focusing all that great is because the lighting is I don't have the best lighting in this room and this is the only room I can record in so I'm looking at ring lights I actually have one in my cart and I that's when I'm like you idiot you have a laptop light bar that you don't use. So I thought, let me come home, try that out, see how it works. And if it seems like it works okay, then I don't have to worry about the ring light. Ring light. But if the if it still doesn't work that great, I can always still do the ring light. So anyhow, go to the store, and I'm just looking around, and come across Tim Tams. Now, when I was down at International Market, Australia is right next to the UK and, and the uh, International Market. And I saw the Tim Tams and I thought, ooh, it's been a while since I had Tim Tams because the uh, local Kroger used to carry them at one time. And then for some reason, they stopped, car stopped carrying them. And it's just like every store, it's like they stopped carrying stuff just for... I don't, I don't know if it's the sales or import cost or what, because uh, the Walmarts used to carry McFitty Digestive Biscuits, and then all of a sudden they didn't. <clears throat> so anyhow, you seen the price. They were $4, which aren't cheap, but at the international market, they were like 8 or 9 bucks a package. So I'm like, you know what? I get two packages for what I could pay for down there for one package. I'm not going to buy them a lot. I, I'm just buying them primarily for uh, taste testing. So as a one-time purchase, I can justify it. I get crumbs from lunch. So yeah, that's where we're at. So. I've already got a couple of videos already made that uh, are on a schedule to release on YouTube that's already been uploaded and just on a schedule to release 
I'll have to look at what uh, uh, for sure what what days I put those on. I know I have. I think I don't think I have any coming out tomorrow, but I think I have Sunday and Monday already scheduled. Now, if I have a food tasting one on or the snack tasting one on Monday, what I'll do is I'll leave it there. I'll probably do Wednesday as a uh, travel tip video, Thursday or Friday as the second taste testing video, and I'll also have the weekly Friday update video that way. I can keep you guys informed of what's what you can look forward to, what scheduling is, and what in general is going on. Um, things are a little screwy right now. I, I was actually motivated enough uh, on my days off to actually shoot s several videos, so that actually got me up up to speed of getting some content up and at them. But uh, I'm generally not like that. I'm sometimes it takes a lot for me to get motivated to do do these things. And also, I have this issue where I'll be really interested in doing something for a little while, then I'll get complacent and bored, and it doesn't interest me anymore. And I'm hoping that's not the case. I'm hoping that this is that one thing that I will stick with. So, time will tell, but we'll cross our fingers. Um, my work schedule is <laughs> is a fun one because not only am I working two different shifts during the week, but then I, I have someone who's constantly asking me if I can switch days, which I don't mind it so much because I, I'm working a part-time schedule. I'm working... I'm working four days a week, but I'm working two full shifts, which are on second shift, and two half shifts, which are overnight. And right now, that's what I can handle. So, sleep schedule is kind of screwy. Not that it was ever good to begin with. But, that's where that's at. So, I will try by the next time. By next week, hopefully I will have a schedule set up, and that way, if there are people who are watching these videos and are like, well, specifically, like, it's not so much the uh, food tasting ones, but like the uh, travel tip videos for London, if that's something that they're interested in, and they're, and they're like, a week goes by and they don't see one, it's like, well, is he making any more? I just kind of want to be more consistent on that. So I'm going to wrap this up. And I hope for the ones who have been watching the videos, they've enjoyed the videos. It gives them a kind of an insight on, uh, as far as the snack tasting, gives them insight on what is out there for other countries. Whether you're going to another country, as, as like the UK, what snacks you can uh, expect to find or if you're going to go to an international market and you're just like you know what I want to try something different so we're going to wrap it up I'm Sappy Nirvana and bye ya.